So how is the Fluidine C1 system going to change how we treat patients in the future? So let me put this in the context of what we're doing now. So in the clinic, most patients are treated based on a small number of barcodes that are identified in pathology or through molecular diagnostics. So their treatments would usually be radiation therapy, chemotherapy, or biologicals. And this is all well and good, and it has indeed improved clinical outcomes and survivorship. However, with the Fluidine C1 system, we can now look at individual cancer cells within the tumor bulk and be able to actually understand with precision what the molecular changes uh, that have taken place within the entire tumor. And based on this, we can do a number of things. We will either continue with the treatments that are in place, because in fact they are the best treatment course for the patient, or we can design and develop new targeted strategies that are precise for the individual patient.